your own understanding. Truth under Babylon's empiricism. What up? Uh, on here real quick to add my three cent to that whole Tiffany Haddish, Airy, Airy Spears uh, nonsense. Yeah, uh, definitely sad, uh, but true, unfortunately. Uh, I was I was like the brat with it. I was like, yeah, no, nah, I, I don't believe it. I wanted to see more. You know, I got to see more. Saw more. Yuck more. Um, can't believe it. Couldn't believe it. The whole skit. I mean, the whole skit, the whole... <laughs> the, whole, the whole idea behind the skit They named the skit through the eyes of a pedophile that, that was the first mistake Actually the first mistake was even Taking the kids over there by Tiffany Taking the kids and dropping them off You know For the skit or just period Was the first mistake um, Second mistake is naming that skit Through the eyes of a pedophile Third mistake is actually um, <laughs> Performing that skit Performing that that script that was written, whoever wrote that script needs to go bye bye, just for writing that shit, uh, and the participants definitely. Now, here you have something difficult because now you have these two uh, figures that are mainly being implicated for this. Um, so you have Tiffany Haddish and Aerie Spears. Aerie Spears followed through with the the process of basically facilitating the whole uh, visual aspect of the sex tape because that's because it was a sex tape and I'll explain it to you I'll explain to you how I come to the uh, come to terms about it being a sex tape so he facilitated the the whole nonsense the actual uh, process of you know <laughs> playing out the perverted uh, uncle so the things that were done to the kids, the scenes that were shot with the kids, um, just uh, what everything was implying in regard to the entire skit itself, the actual practice of the skit, it all it all should not have happened. None of it should have happened. None of it, and it's disgusting. And it wasn't funny, you know. Allegedly, Tiffany decided that she wanted to say, "Yeah, uh, it was in bad taste," but you knew that when you read the script, though. Um, or even if the idea just came and you were just kind of, you know, improving, and just the fact that you had to improv something like that should have had you asking questions if you didn't really know. Like all this, all this shit is is obvious, you know. But the uh, the sad part about it is these two, they're gonna have to go bye bye. Like they they're gonna have to go bye bye. Why? Because number one, <laughs> Aerie Spears. Um. You could be charged with uh, reckless endangerment, perverse and reckless endangerment of a minor. Now, there might be other charges also, but that's just one off the top of my head that you know you could definitely be implicated for. Uh, so, with that though, because of the event and the nature of the event, Tiffany Haddish, even in the skit, drops the children off. Oh, unk, could you watch? Blah blah blah. Oh, oh, unk, could you watch? I'm not gonna. Obviously, we ain't gonna show it because it's just, just, just stupid. I don't like to show graphics anyway because I like to have you use your imagination and your own discretion to go out and you know go out and research. Just research for yourself if you feel like it's necessary. If not, you move on. But that's the, that's why I do it like this. Plus, it's plain and simple. Plus, YouTube be tripping. You're gonna snatch things off and you'll be wasting your time. So I'm gonna say what I'm gonna say anyway. But you know, it is what it is. But yes. So because Tiffany, even in the skit, drops the kids off, and in real life, she actually takes the kids from wherever they were to the area so they could be filmed, uh, or so they could be uh, subject to that uh, perverse, <laughs> reckless endangerment of a child. It's not funny, but it's ridiculous that I have to say this shit. Um, she could be charged with trafficking. I think that's worse than, than what Aries would be charged for, and she did less as far as actual you know participation but yeah she could be charged with trafficking if it if it all goes down like that and that's a damn shame off of you know if you there's no way you can say oh it's just an innocent skit we just did that just to be you know just to be funny or did that for what to bring aware to what no you you did that that was a sex tape like a kardashian sex tape how is it a sex tape well because you know there are uh what they uh call Hmm, I was going to say something. <laughs> there are 
people out here that want to misclassify or classify in a negative light the little nuances of sexual irresponsibility. So when you're not responsible or you don't understand the laws of energy and how to apply them, when you deal with sexual energy, um, you're reckless. You're, you're irresponsible. You use it as a weapon. And so here, um, with all of the other factions, all the other uh, phases of sexuality that we have here today, uh, they want to add something like having sex with children as an actual you know, sexuality, pedosexuality. So, this tape that they made is promoting a sexuality. So it's a sex tape. Is it an audition tape for Hollywood to try to get to that spot? It seems like everybody that wants to get in entertainment or get exposure, they have to come out, you know, and rub on that wood like in the Apollo. But they, instead of the wood, it's a fucking kid. Like, this is ridiculous, man. I'm, I'm like, all this shit that's going down and coming to the light is just wild, man. Just wild, wild, wild. And it comes from a culture. The culture of, of exploitation. Because when you exploit a person enough, they'll do anything. Sacrifice the whole integrity, their, their, their self-worth, their self-preservation. All that goes bye-bye. And this is a prime example of nonsense that is, is, that's happening as a result of all this oppression. Both of them adults knew damn well what they was doing, why they was doing it, when they was doing it. And they used them kids. That's exploitation. This shit's just a, it's a mess. I'm, I'm, I gotta go. But anyway, yeah, so Tiffany could, she could go down for trafficking, which is probably the worst charge. And your, your man's, they call them raccoon eyes. I, 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 just, I don't get into all that. I just, I don't know why I said it, but that's what they call them. But anyway, yeah, he, he going down for reckless endangerment, perverse, perverse reckless endangerment of a minor. Uh, actually two of them so there's a couple charges with that and then whatever else that they come up with because it's all relevant shit nasty 